Molto bene, grazie Gio. Thank you. Stadler and then Mr. Tarabella. Thank you. I'd like to pick up on what colleague Agnew was saying. I also think that there's no reason for this regulation and that the protests we've heard are incredibly high and strident. Uh, colleague Kernbach um, talked about the reactions. It's, people have been very critical in Austria. It's completely unnecessary. There's no reason for this new rule. There's no major pests or events in agriculture that would demand this. Nothing's happened. It's quite simply the interests of the agricultural industry. Now, listen to what uh, colleague Dorfman was said. Even now, if you buy seeds, you, you, you can go to court against somebody if the, if the seeds isn't what it says. So we don't need anything extra. This, we don't have this kind of difference between what things say they are and what they are. It, it, it's not to a point of this being necessary. So, you know, you could, if you can prove this, then you can go to court. So we don't need this. It's an additional um, procedure wanting to cover other producers. It's just going to drive people out of the market by erecting barriers. You know, bureaucracy is fine for people who have the apparatus to deal with it, but it's, the small producers don't, and they're driven out of the market. You know, they're not huge companies with a mar dominant position. It's always the small producer, people in niche products and what will happen, we'll have um, homogenous certified products and uh, we, we design the best seeds for this at the same time and it's all in the interests of the agricultural industry. So, uh, the population is against this trend, and that's good. Uh, so, I agree uh, with colleague Sylvester, Sylvestris that there is a need to amend this. So, it's not... Uh, we, we, we shouldn't be reducing the numbers of micro-companies by extending the number of companies covered by this. Oh, quite the opposite. If we're going to do this, it has to just be concentrated on the big companies that dominate the market. Uh, you know, we don't we don't need a European Union and European Commission otherwise.